Father, it has been one week since my last confession. Tell me your sins, boy. I have disrespected my mother and my father, but this week I do plan on killing four men. Don't do that. The father would not be pleased. Sorry, father. It's too late for that. Fellas, go home. Have a nice night. Yes, sir. See you tomorrow. All right, see you later, man. See you. It's been real with him. Yeah, I heard after, you know, one of our meetings, you know, he was walking out, doing this casual stroll down to his car, you know, as some cool captain. Oh, yeah, it's just sad. But, hey, how's Sally doing? Oh, doing good, yeah. Yeah, man. I don't know, but more, interesting, but more important, how's her sister? Fine, too. Fine? All right. She, she, hook, she, hook, she hook me up sometime. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. All right. What was that? Boys, what can I do for you? meeting. Oh yeah? I didn't tell anybody. I didn't. You know I'm not a snitch. What about you? No way. No way. No. You're lying. Uh, I ain't no liar. Who's lying? He is. Who is lying? Not me. Not me. Uh, sure about that? Yeah. I'm sure. So you're telling me neither of you told our killer about this meeting. How do you know where to be? And when? Huh? Somebody talk! I'm gonna get real angry. Real angry. Talk. I don't know. I don't know anything. Hey, you know, you know, the groundskeeper, he, he... He might have been here. What's his name? I don't know. It's a thing. Jerry or something like that? I'm not, I'm not too sure. You get him for me. Alright, no problem. No problem. Now, go. Man. Get out of here. Both of you, get. Can I, can I take this? No. Take your cloak, dude. Turn it out. You're with the detectives. You drop something there. Jerk. Jeez. So I'll stake it. Well, I was looking over this evidence. Figured out we have no leads. Yeah, that's really done. So I was just thinking that uh, we don't need anything. Uh, was, did, did the gun? Oh yeah, yeah, it's right here. You did? Oh, yeah, I kind of in a sketchy neighborhood. All right. Well, I have to go get some for Sally. So really? Yeah. And you know my wife. So. I'm get getting whipped, my friend. <laughs> All right. Anyways, okay. I'll see you later. See you.
Said he's with his wife Sally, something like that. Uh, you just over there. I'll check back here. I got nothing. We, we gotta just keep looking around. Wait, is that him? Oh my goodness. He's got no bolts. He's cold. It's pretty dead to me. Well, better go tell Chief. Yeah, it's a bummer. Chief, we gotta talk. Boys? <coughs> we lost someone today. Who? We lost John. How'd you lose him? Laceration to the throat. Where'd you find him? I found him in the basement. Well, I didn't eat it. And who are you? I'm the groundskeeper. You're the one, the one you were looking for. So I reckon you know about both these then? Yes, sir. I found him. Okay. So tell me about it. What do you know? It's a tragedy. All I know is I just stumbled upon two dead bodies within a couple days of each other. So you don't know my piece it together. How, where'd you find my assistant? He, uh, I found him in the parking lot. Right out this window? Yes, sir. What happened? It seemed as if someone had hit him in the back of the head and then shot him. And that's all you know? That's all I know. What about the other guy? My chief. My police. Laceration to the throat. Found him in the basement. How long ago? Just a couple hours ago, sir. You don't know anything else? No, sir. You sure? Possibly. Okay, what here. do you know? I'm just here to keep and protect these crowns. How do you let this happen? You're his partner. That's two guys now. Three days. Talk. Is he your friend? Yeah. No, he's not. They both were. We've known each other forever. And I haven't known him? No. Not really. Not like I did. I'm his boss. We were roommates. And I don't know him? Yeah. Sir, sir, sir. You sir. wouldn't do that, sir. Try me. All I know? I'm very emotional right uh -huh. now. Uh-huh. I can do anything. Yeah? yeah? I can do anything. Show me! You two keep it part. You guys work together. You gotta you gotta solve this. Stay together. He was my friend too. You know, I hope he's next on your list. You deserve to die. Get out of here. Make me. Get! No! Ow! Hey! You two need to work together. Now calm down, both of you. You're my lead investigator. Figure this mess out, or you're fired. Let's go clean this mess up. Let's go. Let me get my jacket. You know, these are really tough times, and uh, I just wanted to apologize for once again out of hand. That's all right. It's it's tough times. I mean, you're losing guys. It has to be tough to be in charge. It, yeah, definitely is. Um, the reason I brought you out here is because I need a guy. You know, I can't um, just have guys step in and out. I, I'm losing them, so I, I really just need a guy right now to investigate and figure some things out. All right, I'd be happily doing that. I mean, I can help you with that, whatever you need. I mean, uh, I'm here for you. Okay, thank you. Um, really, honestly, first, first order of business I would have to say is we gotta get rid of those bodies. All right, do you want me to go finish that right now? Get rid of them? Um, yeah, I think my guy's down there. Just um, holler at him and help him out. That'd be All great. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Take some notes, and then I'm gonna send up the autopsy. Why? What, what do you, you want me to call a coroner? I can get somebody down here to pick it up. Um, if you really want to, I mean, sure. 
Alright, see you in a bit. Bye. Sit down. Sit down. Okay, how do you know? Tell me everything. So, I was, uh, I was going out of the autopsy on John's body, right? Yeah. And so, <clears throat> he comes down there behind me. I sent him down. Okay, alright. And he, uh, um. <coughs> oh, <I'm> slow down. <coughs> slow down. Easy. He's asked me a bunch of questions. I was taking notes about John. And then he asked me what I'm going to do with the body. I said, I don't know. You can take care of it if you want. And then right as he walks off, I get whacked in the back of the head. It wasn't him or was? I don't know. Well, I don't think it was him. Because when I woke up from me being unconscious, I saw another guy with him that walked in the door. I don't know what room we were in, but it was just that side room next to where John The old boiler room. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then... Hold on, do we know this guy that was with him? No. I we'll probably have him on file. He looks really familiar. Okay. And so... I pulled out my gun, shot the guy, and ran out. Which guy? The guy that was with the groundskeeper. So this groundskeeper is still in this building? Yes. Alright, we need to go figure this out. Take this. I'll come with you. Let's go. What do you think they were doing when he came down here? I don't know, probably it was some man stuff. Think so? Yeah. He came to get stuff for salad. Uh-huh. So I, I don't really... There. I'm not really sure. There's... Hey Tom, how you doing? Hey Tom, hey guys. No! Shoot! Put her down! Shoot! Put her down! Fine! 
Ya. Ya. Oh, back. last week, including a priest. You might think it was all. 